Hello, hello, welcome back to another anime art video. My name is Dennis and I'm a beginner artist and in today's video, I'm going to be drawing <sighs> another member from Burdock's group. Um, I've drawn Burdock before, so that's the only reason why I didn't draw Burdock now. And I kind of wanted to draw him again, like with him wearing like the blood red bandana. I wanted a, and I say blood red, not implying like the gang bloods, but I'm saying a blood red bandana because the bandana was actually white. And then it, well, it's not even a bandana. It was a white cloth that got soaked in blood that he tied around his head. I just called it a bandana because it, he tied it around his head. So, um, I don't even know why I had to clarify that because uh, obviously I don't equate just a color to be like anything gang related in general. I don't think that a whole gang should regulate whether or not other people can wear a specific color of clothing. It makes no fucking sense, especially since those gangs were not the originator of the fucking color. Uh, yeah, it's understandable if like somebody wants to like, you know, go around repping something they they rep that thing with the saying like you know like oh we're this we're that right but i shouldn't have to if i want to go out and match like if i want to wear all black i can wear all black but if i want to wear all red then it becomes a problem you know like i don't like i don't think that should be a thing i i think um like indicators would like you like in order for that to be an indicator, you would have to have a, like a specific type of thing on you. So like if you want to use bandanas as an uh, as an as a means to discern who your group is, wear a bandana like around your wrist, around your forehead or in your back pocket, something like that. But don't just like, you know, blatantly, uh, blatantly be like, oh, you can't wear this color or else you're going to be associated with this group of people and yeah, it makes no sense to me. But uh let's get into this. Then fly to home But if you wanna travel Then go alone Yeah, what's the point in us If I never know yeah, If you're gonna leave I'ma let you go I'm 
broken home I gave you all the bricks that I own and know I'm letting go, I'm breaking these walls down Breaking these walls down If you want adventure, then fly to home But if you wanna travel, then go alone Yeah, what's the point in us if I never know? Yeah, if you're gonna leave, I'ma let you go Okay, I am actually extremely happy with this picture and not because of the face, right? That's that's kind of give or take, you know, I can either do good with the face or bad with the face. But one thing that's been consistent is that I'm bad with hands. But this hand in particular, I think came out really, really well even the like the finger like it like this like looks like this right essentially but normally this would have ended up like looking like like you know like something weird like like something like off like it'll look like this like <laughs> or something you know it's just weird but i think it came out uh fairly decent but uh, that's it for this video. If you liked it, be sure to leave a like, subscribe. If you didn't, let me know what I can do in the comment section to make it better for you to watch next time. The glove is off. Peace. Love. Thanks for watching.